Also today, we're learning more about the home where yesterday morning shootout happened with Thornton police. There were two officers hurt. One was shot. The other was hit by glass and shrapnel. Thanks for joining us for 4 o'clock at 9 News. I'm Tom Green. I'm Alexandra Lewis. After the shooting, Sky 9 video captured a man seen sitting on his porch. 9 News investigates Kelly Rinke joins us now to walk us through that video and tell us what she's learned. Hi, Kelly. Hi, hi guys. Thornton police have not confirmed this is their suspect. They instead deferred us to an outside team doing this investigation. But Thornton PD yesterday has said only one person was in the house at the time of the shooting. Sky 9 captured this, a man sitting at a table on a backpack. He gets up from the couch, puts his hands in the air and walks back inside the house. And then once he walks back inside, you see at the doorway some debris that starts to fly into the air. It appears that someone may have fired a gun. This video was recorded around 930 in the morning. Thornton police told us he walked out of the house and shot at officers around 905. I spoke to a man who previously owned that that house. He said he sold the house a few years ago to a father, mother and son. The dad had passed away. People who live next door also told us a mother and son lived at that home. Tom. Like so many of these cases, there's uh, plenty to still understand about why this all happened, and uh, we continue to try to learn more. Yeah, they are investigating this. We still don't know the identity of the man who uh, died in this house in the shooting. That identification has not been released by the coroner's office. All right, Kelly, thanks.